Our coverage continues from Dowdy Ficklin Stadium. It's East Carolina taking on South Florida tonight at 7:30. Sports Director Brian Bailey will be by in just a minute with a preview of tonight's matchup. But first, it's this week people in places and the story of one man who's traveled the world only to come back home and start over. Now he's using cocktails and the stories of his adventures to bring the community together. One of the tiniest buildings in Kinston sits at the corner of Mitchell Street and French Lane. It's tiny, but dynamite comes in a small package. This is Stanley's saloon, the brainchild of one man. My name is Travis Stanley Harper. Born in Kinston and raised in Greene County, Harper not only owns the place, he's also the sole bartender. My running theme is kind of craft cocktails with a story. So each picture's got a story, each drink's got a story. And those stories began accumulating about a decade ago, represented by the dozens of pictures adorning the walls. Basically spent my entire 20s traveling the world, all 50 states. Then to Central America. I went to Costa Rica, then we went to Nicaragua. Across the Atlantic to Europe. Germany, Austria, Italy, and Switzerland. Down to South America. Peru, Bolivia, and Chile for a month. Literally got like a, a travel addiction, which I think was a good addiction to have. Back in the U.S., he lived and worked in Southern California for a bit. Pretty much catering to celebrities. I served Jay-Z his own champagne, so at the Chateau Mormont in Hollywood on Sunset Boulevard. But the pull to travel abroad grew stronger. Thailand for a month, Vietnam for a month. I went to Sumatra, Indonesia for a month, and then back to Vietnam to start teaching English, which I randomly got a job doing out there. And about that time, the coronavirus pandemic hit. And I was magnetically being pulled back to Kinston. It was just, I was meant to be home. And a few months later, the idea for Stanley's saloon came about. That's what I was good at. I always ended up behind a bar or at one, so I might as well try to figure out how to get my own. He even cleaned beach houses over the summer to earn extra money to fix up the place. I'm glad to have him back. <clears throat> I'm glad to be back. Ain't no place I'd rather be now. That's Travis's mother, Terry. She helps out at the saloon, ecstatic her son is back in ENC. I never thought he would want to settle down here, really. He's just really brought out a great to the community here in Kinston, too, really. And I think it's super, super that he's done this. I appreciate that. And what he's done is bring together people from all over Kinston and the East with one goal in mind. I don't want TVs in here. I want human to human connection. I want people to feel at home and lay back here. Just phenomenal guests. I've been having a great time. I've been having the best conversations. I'm hoarse right now from talking so much. So I've been loving it, man. I really have. No Jay-Z yet, though. No, Jay-Z hasn't shown up yet. In the meantime, Travis says he's happy to be back home, serving up drinks and striking up conversation with new friends. I think this adventure is, is probably fulfilling me just as much, if not more, than, than, than any adventure I've ever been on. And it's the old saying, you know, all roads lead home, and that fits you perfectly. That's true. And I'll say, the road goes on forever, but the party never ends. <laughs> <laughs> That's another one. <laughs> And be sure to check out my latest People in Places Extra podcast for the full conversation with Travis Harper to learn more about his world travels. You can find it on the WNCT Podcast Network, Spotify, and wherever you get your podcasts.